dear students, today we gonna get a story with a new lesson, lesson three with the grade six. So we have already got started with a new chapter of talks about surface areas of a lot of polygons. So today we gonna start with a new kind of uh, polygons, surface areas of rectangle, prisms, triangle, prisms, and pyramids. So. When we got started, the most important thing in our lesson is the formula. So before you get started with doing anything, you have to put the formula of your polygon. Before that, you have to know the objective of our lesson. Going to be use the net of a solid figure to find its surface area. And our essential question going to be how can you use the net of solid figure to find its surface area? So the main point in our lesson that you have to find out the net of solid figure, yani net of your form, then you have to find out surface area of this solid figure. Okay, so let's get started with example number one. A cube has side length of four centimeters. You use the net of cube to find the surface area. So First uh, step gonna be uh, write the formula. Uh, I know that a cube has no formula, but I know that a cube has six lateral sides of squares. So you have to find out the area of a square. After that, after you find the area of a square, you will multiply it by six lateral sides to find out the surface of a cube. So as you can see here, we have to draw the net of surface, the net of cube. So to find the surface area of cube, you have at first to draw the net of this cube. As you can see here, we have one, two, three, four, five, and six squares. Six equals squares. So if you have to find out um, area of square, you have to put the formula and we have already known that the area of square equals side squared so if we have this side 4 4 squared equals to 16 and don't forget to put the unit so it's going to be 16 centimeters squared for each square so we have six squares each one of them the area